Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, Ogano here, and I'm going to be doing a uh, breakdown of my comic or uh, explaining my process in the manga making. So, we'll, we'll get down to uh, business here. So, right here, first thing that you can see is the fact that I didn't have a very strong lines. They weren't they were very weak they weren't solid lines here and that's due to the fact of how I was uh, scanning my work previously on uh, manga studio and uh, I ended up fixing the problem like really really later on during like uh, I think that it's my is the 12th page here so look weak lines is very like pixelated and whatnot. So w when we come here, you can see this is when I started uh, learning about uh, how to scan your uh, traditional work properly. I just it's just a simple Google search, you know. So as you can see here, the the lines here at least they're a a little bit more solid compared to uh, these pixelated lines so that's one of the mistakes uh, another thing when I was just starting out is the fact that I'm not gonna say all but some of the characters that I that I have as you know main people of the story their uh, designs weren't planned as much for example this guy here peace or person person this person here peace he's uh well <laughs> um yeah sorry guys something came up but yeah this person guy girl you're not supposed to know who it is uh I didn't really plan the design as much and like later on throughout my uh when I started school I started thinking about hey I, I should have really designed these characters better I mean, like, previously, I think last year I had this, uh, um, plantar fasciitis case. I, I just felt a lot, a whole bunch of chronic pain, and it did give me some time to think about my, uh, pages and my characters and whatnot. And I noticed, like, a, a lot of flaws while during my school, school semester when I started also during the time when I where I had this chronic pain and I couldn't really draw or do anything you know so I basically redesigned his design over here and now that you see and another thing the uh, uh, the text or uh, the sound effects they didn't really pop up pop out as much so as you can see here you can't really tell that this is Gump, or he's munching or something, but yeah, you can't really tell. The the lettering is so skinny, and I mean, I I don't know about you guys, but if I was you know object objectifying myself to looking at this text, then I wouldn't be able to. Uh, uh, maybe I would. Okay, I, I might. I'm getting off topic, but basically, it didn't stick out. It didn't stick out this sticks out more so I made changes there um also I speak about not uh, planning some of my designs here I didn't think about um some of these colors that I used and uh, some of these characters they were uh, yeah I, I didn't like think about the um the designs as much I thought about it like during the uh the process of me making the pages but not beforehand on the sketchbook you, you understand what I'm saying so um that was another thing um what else there's a uh, oh and also I started uh, experimenting with uh, some of the uh, screen tones for uh, the backgrounds here so yeah, that's another thing.
but I ended up using just making my own cloud background for the sky uh, and then there is another thing I ended up redoing these two pages here just simply for the fact um, I didn't like the uh, scene I didn't think it really captured what my character was like also I didn't enjoy the design this was another uh, issue that I have I just didn't like design my characters it, it wasn't really well planned out for the design so um another thing another, another thing this uh this huge panel here it, it takes out a whole bunch of space and I felt that I could have you know done something with it but on the recent uh, changes that I made I just decided to keep it because um I wanted it to maintain the same feel that the old page had you know and so I did so these were basically the uh, redesigns that I made for it um also I don't like how these clouds look I, f I felt perhaps that these were a lot better I mean I could have improved on the clouds uh what else uh, yeah uh, th this is basically where my uh, skill was at like the at the uh, beginning of the summer like this May yeah this was basically where my skill was at I decided to redo a lot of things redo a lot of the character designs and yeah I redid them and yeah just redone Oh, what's going on, guys? Um, I kind of paused to stop myself from having an awkward silence during the video. I didn't want to skip anything during the video, and anything important. So yeah, basically, um, from pages one to nine, or one to eleven, is where I stopped the manga process until I got this chronic pain, and then I started uh school then I start got to get started on my classes like last year yeah that that's when I stopped and then I got back to it like during uh, I feel this summer yes yeah yeah this summer I got back to it and I wanted to redo some things for example this and the character designs for for this and this that's all I redid and then I started back on page uh, 13 I feel or not I I'm not sure but it was probably 13 or 18 oh I think I started like 13 like during like I when I had like a Christmas break but any anyway, I don't want to get off tangent um on a tangent but okay moving on again the same, you know, rugged, pixelated lines until I got, until I actually learned how to scan and what else? Another thing, yes, this. Uh, I spent like uh, f four to five hours just working on the background uh, for a uh, this and I have gotten uh, a lot more faster and improved uh, again you, as you can see here there's a lot of uh, rugged lines also I didn't use uh, these backgrounds weren't really fleshed out compared to what I have now with um, with uh, here oh sorry the motorcycles <laughs> Um, I don't know if you can hear it, but there's like a lot of motorcycles flying by. I mean, riding by. 
You know what I mean. Anyway, um, where was I? The, yeah, the shadows didn't really. I have. Oh, sorry. Um, yeah, the uh, things here, they, uh, they they didn't pop out. Okay, yeah, they didn't pop out. Now, I'm now right here. This is like my fastest background. While I spent like a like four to five hours doing this I spent like a uh, good one to two hours just doing this and I felt that I could I, I yeah I think it's one one hour or two hours I, I'm not sure I don't remember but um this was my most fastest page just simply due to the fact that I let go of you know self-doubt and I started following my instincts and you know but ours to say, you know, going with the flow, being present with the drawing. And I feel that's really important. Because, you know, I feel it's already in you. You just gotta, you know, put it out there. Don't let thoughts complicate things. Don't let your thoughts complicate matters or things are very simple okay okay let's let's move on yes um um okay now here I started like uh, experimenting with a lot of uh, A lot of uh, how should I say this? I, I just I just try to make page, the page fancy, basically. And uh, right here, um, as you can see, compared to the uh, older backgrounds here, first it was this, first it was this flat, then it was this, as you can see here and then I started you know fleshing it out a little bit more with the shadows um and uh, also 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 as opposed to before I started adding a lot more uh, background details to my work compared to what I did uh, previously just background details to each and every panel. I try to keep it uh, balanced. Oh, uh, yes, yeah, so another thing I wanted to speak about. Uh, there is uh, the script. The script. You know, I was originally planning on these pages to be around like just 30 or 30 one you know but um they just ended up coming out to around like 40 pages which was kind of surprising to me so like at the end i started like you know putting in a bunch of panels into one page even though it is visually better for it to you know to have a just less panels. I don't know. You, you got to make it work. But this th this had a lot of panels that I wanted to uh, you know separate to different pages. However, um, you know I had a page limit. I wanted to you know tell as much as possible according to the script. So I couldn't really go above. 40 pages plus um, you know t topo plastic they don't really accept above 40 pages so yeah that's another reason um awkward silence Paul, let, let, let me pause. Hold on. All right, guys. So that's all I got for now.
probably when I'm done making this video, I'm going to think about so many things I probably should have said that I've forgotten to say in this video. But, yeah, just, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. So, yeah, yeah. Peace, guys. Peace.